So this is our current science cart, and today what we're trying to teach is about infectious diseases, especially with Ebola being in the news so prevalently and the enterovirus. Uh, we've been wanting to make sure that we're connecting with visitors uh, the best ways of sort of combating these infectious diseases. That's oil on your hands. Oh boy. Right? We so we're talking about the importance of washing your hands using soap. The first jar uh, is a jar filled with water and uh, you see a separated solution because that's vegetable oil sitting on top. And there's a lot of dirt in between. As you shake this up, uh, you can see that everything starts to swish around. It separates out and the dirt falls to the bottom. It doesn't do a good job of cleaning your hands. The other jar is also water and oil and dirt, but it has soap added into it. And the soap allows for things to bind together so that it allows for all that dirt to be washed away when you wash your hands. And we're gonna look at this. Now also at the table, we have a special device called the ProScope. It's a handheld microscope that allows us to get an up close look at your hands. But what you can also find in a lot of hidden places where dirt can be trapped. So you might look at your hands and think, yeah, they look pretty clean. But as you get closer and closer and the microscope helps us get to another step, it allows us to see something you might not be able to pick up with just your own eye. A lot of the transmission of diseases, bugs, parasites, nasty stuff, happens because of your hands. Hand-to-hand -hand contact, hand-to-mouth -hand contact. So your hands are the number one, or one of the number one transmitters of diseases. And so by merely washing your hands in a very productive, regular way, we can significantly lower the amount of disease transmission we're doing in small areas, in schools, in populations, in society. So if you really think if your hands are clean, we can show you all the sorts of places where germs might be hiding. We have a special activity called our Glow Germ. It is a cream that you rub into your hands until it completely disappears, but it shows up under UV light. And that UV light is really, really powerful, powerful stuff. So after you rub this all in and you can see what your hands look like glowing under this beam, you go and wash your hands and see how well you're doing with washing your hands. And we can find all the places you might have missed by using the light again to see what works. Not as bad. Not as bad. Turn your hands over for me. Not as bad. Not as bad. All right, bud.